Hey guys, so I got a request uh, for doing benchmark uh, for NR6.0.1 Galaxy S3 and S6 so I thought why not I should make a combined video of all these phones here so you can see I have my Galaxy S3, my S4, my S5 and my S6 here all these are running on Android 6.0.1 um, this is basically, let's see here not so fast Galaxy S3 Okay, let's close everything here. Oops, I don't know how to close it on the S3, but I uh, see here if we go into settings and about phone section, you can see it's Android 6.0.1. Let me just zoom in here a little bit. Same thing here for these phones. about phone section and or 6.0.1 and all these are running CM13 or Sonogenmar 13 whatever you wanna call it I might do other tests also you know talking about the you know, how my experience are, is going with these custom marshmallow devices so uh, you can see here all phones are, enter, are on the Android 6.0.1 and I'm just gonna see here um, all of them are connected to the Wi-Fi connection except the Galaxy S6 so we're just gonna enable that okay so all of them are not now now connected so I'm just gonna quickly close everything in the background I'm going to do the same thing here on my Galaxy S3 okay, so for, for some reason I can't really access my um, my my recent tab or multitasking area so we're just gonna go ahead and launch the Benchmark app here. So in this video, we're gonna be testing out Geekbench 3. Okay. Same thing over here with the Galaxy S6. Accept. Accept. Oops. Accept. So we're on benchmark. I mean, definitely a lot of people are interested in this, um, I mean, uh, in these phones performances on 6.0.1 version. Um, basically, what I've seen is that uh, it, your perf the performance will improve, okay? Um, when I first flashed Nexus, uh, the Marshmallow on the Nexus 4, I saw an improvement in the performance. Same for the Nexus 5 and also the Nexus 6 also so you can see here Galaxy S6 is way ahead here almost done 95 percent uploading results it's going to be really nice okay 4768 multi-core not bad 1443 single core then we have the Galaxy S5 here with Snapdragon 801 uh, 3093 and 999 single core you can see here with the S5, some people uh, have uh, scored 5,000 pl 5, plus on TouchWiz, but uh, my S my S6 here, my S6 here uh, scored like 4,000 something, uh, 4,500 something. So I think it's a little bit improvement for me. Uh, Galaxy S4 with Snapdragon 600 scores 2,193 uh, multi-core and 693 single core. And then we have slow Galaxy S3 baby here on 88%. Uh, this is Exynos 7 Octa Core. This is Snapdragon 801. This is Snapdragon 600. And this one is Exynos 4412 uploading results. Let's see here. Okay, what the hell? Okay, it's done. So 440 single core score and 1278 multi-core score so yeah these are the uh, scores that you will get 
if you have 6.0.1 installed. So yeah, if you guys enjoyed this video, please uh, subscribe and also please like this video, share it and all that nice stuff that you can do for me. And stay tuned and I will catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.